guys, we're in Collinsville. This is a, a Burnham hot water boiler. It's feeding a, a radiant system that on the in the basement does the concrete slab and upstairs and on the first floor is in the ceiling of the first floor. Uh, they have one pump and two zone valves. So here's the two zone valves. One and two right here. The uh, the pipes go up and then here's the floor. Uh, you, you can see there's three zones in the floor but there's one return coming back up right here next to the boiler. Um, yeah, we're going to put a new expansion tank. Uh, this is the water feed. They have no backflow preventer, um, so we need to put a backflow preventer. And they do have a drain right over here for the backflow. So that's convenient and easy to do. Um, here's the water heater that they currently have. And there's the, the flu. You know, if they go within 80%, we'll need a liner inside of there. If they go with a... Uh, uh, a combi or a 95% we can vent it out the side and how we would vent it is we'd run our PVC pipe up this way we go into the joist and we go out that side over there so uh, the customer of this had to work with us on removing some of this stuff so we can get the pipes up there and over that direction um, Let's see, I'm also going to look at some other options for them of, uh, of possibly a furnace upstairs in the attic. And we'll see what that would run uh, to do that. So I think that's all I got. Uh, I appreciate it, guys. Thank you. Bye. What does that valve do?